Welcome back to Thunderbang. I am the Filthy Banana, and this is Toy Soldiers for the Xbox 360. In honor of Memorial Day weekend, let's jump back in the past a little bit as we relive this classic memory from all of our childhoods, not necessarily uh, biologically, but reliving it through the, the eyes of our toy soldiers, if you will. So let's go ahead and get our, emplace, uh, our, our emplacements in here so we can get to going be sure to hit that subscribe button you know I'd, I'd appreciate it I mean you know I don't know if you would but I, I personally would but uh, definitely check the description though you'll find out all the ways that you can keep up with us over here at Thunderbang so if you can't tell already Toy Soldiers came out uh, in the 360 generation back in 2010 I think it was uh, from Signal Studios and it was, uh, I, I didn't spend a lot of time with it, even though I, I really enjoyed it. There was always a lot of other things. Oh, I forgot about how good that rumble feels. Get it. Um, but it's a t at, its, at its heart, it's a tower defense game. Um, it's big selling point, though, as you can see right here, is jumping in and getting right in there and getting dirty as you, uh, you weigh lace to the enemy as they approach your toy box which you must protect at all costs from the invading enemies. Come on now, buddy. Yeah, I figure, you know, got Memorial Day weekend here for everybody in the United States. So, what way can we, what can we pull up that would have any type of significance and slot in there? And, well, why not play with toy soldiers like we all did when we were kids? Except, now they're gonna come to life and not be that horrific army men series. Was that back in the PS1 days? Whew, that was a rough one. That was a rough one. Oh, no, 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 I gotta give you the sexy camera. Come on. Here we go. Yeah, that's what everybody came for. Loving it. Oh, no. Gotta love it. So there was a follow-up to this one, uh, Toy Soldiers Cold War, which I, I'm gonna be honest, I did not play, even though it looked super badass. Um, I wanna say I played the demo for it. The big change in that one was, I believe you got um, commandos, uh, you know, kind of like in the vein of G.I. Joe action figures that could come onto the field, like heroes, that you could take control over and kind of run around. Doing a little bit of research before I fired this gem up and did see that Signal Studios is working on a true Toy Soldiers 2, which it looks like back in February they announced coming out hopefully in 2021. And let me tell you, boys and girls, it looks good. It looks like they're making a bunch of changes just from the little blurbs that I was able to go through on the website. A lot, a lot more getting into the trenches, so to speak. I think I've said that a couple times. I'm gonna try not to anymore as I'm getting bum rushed. Come on now. Um, but you know, the way that I described that you can move up and use the commanders, commanders, commandos, I don't know. The hero characters in Cold War, in this one, it looks like you can take, a, they're just stepping that up a little bit more. Uh, and it looks like they're mixing in some land and sea action as well, so that could be interesting. I hear our, our battle horn sounding. I got my barbed wire up. Let's rock! I think they like getting mowed down from distance like this, but I got a toy box to defend, ladies and gentlemen. I think we're too early on for them to start bum rushing us with the uh, the horses. Uh, uh, do like that you can upgrade, and as you go through the levels and progress, you unlock different. Obviously, as you can see, my stuff's locked right now. You can get 
different types of emplacements, you upgrade them accordingly. Um, so there's definitely incentive to play. And like I said, this is definitely one that I, I always liked it. I just, I, there's always something else I'd rather be playing. Would be a solid title if it went over to the Switch. I mean, wouldn't everything at this point? I think a, a two pack. I think they released something like that on the PS4 where it was Toy Soldiers and Toy Story. Toy Story. Toy Soldiers Cold War is a two pack on PS4. I think something like that would work really well on the Switch. Whether or not it would sell a lot, I don't know, but I think it fundamentally would handle great. I'd be pretty excited. I'd probably play it more. Just the convenience of on the go. Man, visually, it shouldn't take a hit. This isn't hurting anything. But let me comment. I don't remember directly on the 360 how this felt in my hand. Um, the vibration. But replaying it on an Xbox One. These, these guns feel good. And they get heavier when you upgrade. It's nice. Okay sweet looking fortification over here big props to the sound in this it's a great sounding title let's go Here, some action. Where, oh, where are you? Oh, I don't know how I did that. Learn something new every day. I like it. Will I be able to repeat that? Probably not. Sexy time. So, no sneaking. Even that subtle little sound effect of the reload right there, it's beautiful. They did a really good job with this. Run into your inevitable death. Just mowing them down. Although, here we go. Flares up. Warns. I see horses. You like that? Oh, that was ugly. Hopefully, nobody from PETA's trolling what we've got here. So we uh, shoot up some toy horses. Guys are pushing it, I'm getting hectic. Last line of defense is uh, really holding up as we uh, finish things off here with our poor tank, or APC, I don't know what to call it, other than dead. We'll call it dead. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is victory, because that's what we do. We come out victorious. And on this Memorial Day weekend, I hope everybody comes out victorious and stays safe and has a wonderful, safe holiday weekend. All that wonderful jazz. Ready to take the bull by the horns and just charge forward with life and all those other random things that I just muttered for no reason whatsoever. Other than to say, 
Thank you for tuning in. This has been The Filthy Banana. This is Thunderbang. Be sure to hit that subscription button on your way out the door. I will see you next time. Peace.